Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Holly and today I am playing The Devil in Me. Oh my god, I am so excited for this game. So unfortunately, I am a little bit late to it. So basically, uh, I went away literally like a day or two after the game came out and I thought, well, I could start it, but then I'd have to take a massive break in the middle and I feel like that would lead to me getting characters killed because I forgot important details. So I thought as much as it killed me, I would wait until I got back and I'm back now, so I'm starting The Devil in Me and I'm a bit late, but I'm so excited. So in case you don't know, I am a huge, huge fan of the Dark Pictures games and just anything Supermassive puts out. I played The Quarry on my channel earlier this year and loved it. And so ever since House of Ashes came out, I've been patiently waiting for The Devil in Me because I love these games so much. I always have a good time with them no matter what. Basically just like interactive horror is my jam. Like this is why I started my channel almost because I want to document my first playthroughs of how these games go because I love them so much. So needless to say, I've been looking forward to this so much and I'm so excited to finally start it. And I'm especially excited for this one because first of all, the whole uh, hotel premise that looks like it's going to be a bit like a Saw movie or something, that is exciting to me. I'm a horror fan and I like the look of this. Um, but also I think they've said that this game is a bit longer and has a whole bunch of new gameplay mechanics like puzzles and stuff like that, so that is also very exciting. Um, just before we get into it, I will give you a warning for if you haven't watched my The Quarry playthrough that I, I am very passionate about these games. I get so into them and I will treat these situations as if they are life or death and I will get myself very, very stressed out. I will overthink every decision. Um, sometimes I will overthink it so far that it goes back around into like underthinking and being stupid. Um, and I love to like theorize and try to figure out what's happening in the game like before it reveals whatever's going on and I'm always very, very wrong, but that's just part of the fun for me. So yeah, I am just very, very into these games. I'm just warning you how this is going to go before we get started, but I think that's everything. Let's just play the game, shall we? Okay, so I know my playthrough of the quarry was ridiculously bright because of how I had the brightness, but I'm going to do that again because <laughs> I still haven't set up my new monitor, so it's going to be hard to see stuff. Sorry. Hmm, I was thinking about doing lethal, but I that would just stress me out too much, I think. Let's go challenging. Oh boy. For they have sown the wind, and they shall reap the whirlwind. Hosea 8-7. Hey, that's the guy from Red Dead Redemption. <laughs> Every choice has a consequence. Yeah, I know. This ain't my first rodeo. Some decisions save lives. Oh, is the bird going to be our metaphor for today? <laughs> Others. Drugs. <laughs> I thought the drugs was part of the, de the text. Others lead to death. Oh boy. I'm not ready. I'm so excited. Choose wisely. Wait, I'm sorry. I always forget. I always forget to put subtitles on consistently every time. This is uh, it's like a tradition now. Okay, subtitles on. Thank you. Yes. Imagine it. I'm attempting to. World's Columbian expedition continues to draw huge crowds. We should make that our first priority. Whatever Marie. pleases you the most. World's Fair Hotel Chicago. Moment. You mean you are not weary of me after an entire day of Gotta marriage? Gotta turn the volume up. I will never be weary of you. I shall hold you to that, my dear. <laughs> Why does she look a lot like the protagonist already? It's this little hope all over again. I think we've arrived. Uh, also, snake oil treatment was that? <laughs> Ooh, fancy schmancy. Isn't this grand? As advertised. Oh Very no, nice. it's not it's not the protagonist of the game, it's Julia from Man of Medan. Yeah, I remember Let's the face models. <laughs> well, I like this place. I think it looks nice. Are we the only ones here? I'm sure there was a mad dash first thing this morning to get to the fair. Try again. Okay, so 
This is going well. <laughs> Excuse me? Also, I'm sorry well, if I'm talking... I'm sorry if I'm talking really loudly. I got off a plane yesterday and my ears still haven't unpopped, I just realized. So I... Well, sorry. The level of service we're in store for. Oh boy, oh, um... Everyone must be busy elsewhere. Everyone must be busy elsewhere. That's no way to run a business. Slow service. That means they're making sure everything is perfect. The graphics That's my look Marie. really good. Always finding that silver lining. My sincere apologies. Oh. For Hello. For startling you and for making you wait. My attention was needed elsewhere. I promise from here on out it will be nothing but silver linings. Okay, John from Little Hope, you're Welcome already creeping me out. To the World's Fair Hotel. Please, sign in here. First time in Chicago? I'm going to hazard a guess and assume you're here to take in the exposition. The fair, yes, but that's not all. Today is a very special day for us. Aw, congratulations. Oh, a honeymoon. I have a feeling this is not going to go oh, well. Very, very lovely. <clears throat> I love his mustache. Perhaps my wife, Mrs. Whitman, would like to sign. <laughs> yes. Oh, Today I get to pick up the pen. Honeymoon. Oh, amazing. <laughs> I love these games. In that case, an upgrade is in order. A honeymoon suite it is. Yes. Oh, well, uh, are the rates that much higher? <laughs> I think nothing of it. The same rates as your regular room. Aww. The upgrade is on us. You're our first honeymooners. How kind. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. Henry. Howard Holmes. H. H. Holmes. You have a lovely hotel, Mr. Holmes. Well, hey. thank you very much. I designed and built most of it myself. You're an architect then? Architect, designer, builder, doctor, artist. I'm a man of many interests. Are these all going to be things that he does with people Impressive. to torture them or something? Please have a look around. We have sundries and gifts at the pharmacy counter. I'll take your luggage up to your room and ensure that everything is in order. Just make a note if you decide to purchase anything, and we will add it to your bill. So isn't the premise of this game that H.H. H. Holmes is... Thank you, you know, Mr. Let's Holmes. not spoil it. <laughs> we appreciate it. I've read the blurb, though. The pleasure is all mine. This guy's a murderer. I do not trust him to go in my room. Yeah, I'm very creeped out by that man. And these people are definitely going to die. We know how a prologue of a Dark Pictures game goes. Goes Like, these guys are... They are not long for this world. I, I'm so sure that that guy's going to kill them. Ooh. Now, what did I forget Ooh. to bring? Oh, this is new. Um, bath milk? Yeah, why not? Never know when you might need to chug some bath milk on the go. <laughs> oh, fucking hell, a bearing. Marie Perch. It said it was bath milk. Did it not? I purchased the rose water. Well, oh my god, I have an inventory. Oh, this is so cool. Damn it, I, I wanted oh, bath milk, though. Pardon me, miss. Careful, you. My husband gets awfully cross with men who act fresh. Hmm. He sounds like a ripe fellow. <laughs> Top-notch banter, guys. Lovely. Thanks for asking. Well, let's just head up. I'm sure the room is ready. See anything good over there at the jewelry counter? Anything fancy? Wouldn't you like to know?
Yep, something nefarious is going on here. He, he's going to have not finished setting up their murder trap, I'm sure of it. Well, They're going to walk in on him. Here. I'm starting to think I've gone and married a thrill seeker. Ferris wheels, forbidden rooms. Oh, calm down, Marie, you fucking I nutter. <laughs> Nothing but an unfinished room. See what happens when you chase a thrill? Okay, this guy's this definitely dying first. The Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. Wait, what's that? I don't like it. I don't like it. <gasps> don't move. Oh, for fuck's sake, I hate these. I, I hate, oh, these stress me out so much. I'm so bad at these. These are a million times worse than any, like, stay still or whatever. I literally cannot sustain my concentration for that long. <laughs> People are dying. Oh, fuck. I want the don't breathes from the quarry back. They were so easy in comparison. <laughs> that was a thrill. You won't think it's thrilling if we're sleeping on the street after getting kicked out of here. Let's go. Well, this guy must be fun at parties. Well, so what time period is this supposed to be? I'm getting like Titanic era vibes. Nineteen twelve, early nineteen hundreds. And welcome, newlyweds, to the honeymoon suite. <laughs> Thank you kindly, Mr. Holmes. Do enjoy your stay. If you'll excuse me, I have work. To return to. What work? I'm so suspicious of you. <laughs> I'm sure we'll see each other again soon. There is no reason to be that nefarious, my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness, this place is fit for a king. Or my queen. Oh, you. Kiss this. Guys, get a. Oh, okay. That is not very wifely of you. Is it, hey, it going to teach me how to do QTEs I... by throwing questions at her? You asked for it. <laughs> oh my god, it is! <laughs> <laughs> I, I love this. Like if you're smart. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having a hard time containing my excitement today. This is great. I'm having a lovely time. Oh! <laughs> Suck it! Mercy, mercy. I'm sorry, this is the okay, most ridiculous combat tutorial Anything I've ever played, broken? and I love it. Only my pride. How about a peace offering? Hmm. This feels like some sort of treacherous plot. Not at all. I have a gift for you. Close your eyes and face the mirror. Aren't you clever and romantic? If I get a pillow to the face, I will sock you right in the kisser. <laughs> Kiss you right in the socker. Is there a problem? No. Oh, fuck, what? Jeff, sorry, I'm good. I'm another thing in the quarry. I it was probably very annoying how often I check the bearings or paths or whatever, but I'm going to continue to do that because I like to know what's going on. Um, Jeff gave Marie the necklace they pur he purchased from the jewelry counter. Okay, so that was going to happen anyway. Cool. Open your eyes. Oh, Jeff, it's lovely. I love it. Good. We are so going to find Victory that as a clue in the present day. I'll let you have that bath now. Oh, so it was bath milk. <laughs> I have no idea what's happening. Oh, hang on. Oh, what the fuck, dude? Don't they actually do this in some Airbnbs? Like, people find cameras in their rooms? Nothing has changed. <laughs> you 
You can stop making effort sounds now, Marie. <laughs> Maybe if we put a little weight into it? Oh, fuck. <sighs> Open sesame. <laughs> Thank you. Why don't you have a shave while I take a quick bath? Then we can reconvene. I know that word. It's French for something illicit. <laughs> Shush. Shave. I think They're I forgot even to pack hornier my than the teenagers kit. in the quarry. I'm my sure God. The pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that bath. Don't you worry. Somebody's getting murdered. Oh, I'm Jeff. Okay. Oh, it's 1893. Oh, we really are in Red Dead Redemption times. Settle into the hotel and find a shaving kit. Well, okay, I'm gonna do some exploring. Oh, I just love these games so much. Exploring, collecting the clues. Laughing when they say silly things. I, I have such a good time. I really do. Hello? You gotta check every door. I'm also really glad they've updated the, um, the, the, it's not like fixed camera angles anymore. Oh, we got an open door button this time. Okay. Better not. Well, why did you even let me? Oh, this reminds me of. Um, what does this remind me of? It was a hmm. game, like last year. I sworn this was the way we came up. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Does this mean we're in a trippy repeating hallway? What? Oh! Ah! Oh, what the fuck? Oh, that's so cool! Oh my god. Oh my god! Oh, I wasn't expecting that! Marie! Oh my god, I'm loving where this is going already. Not in a sick way, just in a cool horror way. Uh, if that's on screen, I can equip items I have in my inventory. Oh my god! I get to use my bath milk! So, mystery solved. It wasn't rose water, it was rose water scented bath milk. Okay. Glad we've uh, solved that one. Oh, this is so fun. <laughs> was that the. Oh my god, that's the fucking curator in the background. Somebody's gonna die. She's gonna die right now. <laughs> Jump scare. Nope. <laughs> this. Why is this so bright? Don't you know? Never get in a bath if you're in a super massive game. Come on. Rookie mistake. Is that you, darling? Jeff? Oh, are we playing another game? Oh, sweetie, no. <laughs> uh, well, I don't want to investigate, but relax just seems fucking stupid, so... <laughs> Wait. Uh, Marie chose to investigate the noise. Well, either way, I'm dying, so... <laughs> okay, Mr. Smithy. You can't sneak up on me, Mr. <laughs> Holmes. Hello, my dear. What are dear. you doing in here? <laughs> Jeff? I don't think he can quite hear you. <laughs> what are you? Oh, get away from me! But I'm not finished yet. I said get- Is that a razor? Oh my god. Well, he don't was direct into the point. Will only hurt more if you do. Yeah. We're only prolonging. I hit him with the rose water. Yay, I made a good decision. The inevitable. What? What are you? What have you done? Calm yourself, sir. I've seen your wife has had an accident. Um. So scream for help or something, no I don't problem, know. Sir. Uh 
Okay, I, he ran from homes leaving Marie. Oh, yikes. Oh, okay, so he's the architect, meaning he's built this hotel with all sorts of traps built into it. This is so cool. So the hotel does the murdering for you. Oh, come on. <laughs> Come on. Well, we knew she was a goner from the get-go. But, I mean, yeah, go, Marie. You can totally do it. You can totally survive this. Oh, that's hideous. Oh. Marie! Oh, God. Oh, that's horrible. That's really nasty. You're wasting your last death. I love you. <laughs> oh, this is horrible! Oh. Did she not notice the death chamber on the other side? <laughs> Until death do us part two. Okay. Marie bled to death. She sure did. <laughs> oh, poor god. That's really nasty. <coughs> but that thing with the, um... They're like sliding doors in the hallway and then the door that opened to nowhere. That's very... He was killed in the guest room. Okay, I'm guessing that could have happened the other way around. Um, poor guy. But yeah, very cool traps so far. I, I did like the door that went to nowhere and then the trap door with the spikes. This guy is very creative. I'll give him that. Everything in its place. Was that also he could well, pawn their jewelry? Look at this. Oh, it's wonderful. Only the best for you, my dear. Mother would simply die. It's so I say, uh, good man, do you work here? Oh, it's going to happen again. Hello. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Oh my god. Surely he can only get over uh, uh, Surely he can only get away with this so many times. Oh wait. Oh, I love this bit. Oh, oh, death. Won't, Won't you spare me over till another year? Yes, my man. Jesse Buckley. Oh, I, I love the title sequence so much. Although, you do have to sit through it a long time if you want to get the Platinum, which I have for the last three games, so I'm sure I will be bored of it by the end of this game. By the time I get the Platinum, I mean. Well, what is this? I don't know the words. But I like the song, it's kind of cool. What do all the paintings mean? I love the curator as well. This is something I think, like, that I prefer this game to, like, the Quarry or Until Dawn. I prefer the dark pictures as a whole to the Quarry until, or Until Dawn because I think the curator is like a really cool thing to tie all together. I always look forward to our visits, curator. You're very cool. I'd, I'd forgotten I was even going to see him again, but but now I'm pumped. Hi, old friend. Oh, that's a lovely image there. <laughs> it goes so hard. <laughs> One day I want to walk through a long hallway like that and fling the doors open dramatically. We meet again, old chum. Oh. I feel like you've got a graphical upgrade, my oh, friend. Yeah. Have you been waiting long? Yeah, actually. It's yeah. always <laughs> good when a familiar face returns. Obviously, you're in the mood 
for a new tale. Did you remember that I played the last one? He never did that before. Not for me, anyway. <laughs> it's so good to have company. For a long time, I was on my own. I can barely recall a time when I wasn't here, watching over these tales. And what good are stories without somebody to experience them? This is a story about those who create and the lengths they might go to for their art to be made pure. Art can elicit all sorts of reactions. Delight, inspiration, desire, yes, but also doubt, fear, dread. The way you react, the decisions you make, will affect this story. Yeah, I know. Hidden in the world, you'll find dark pictures. They give glimpses of the possible consequences of your choices. And sometimes it's the smallest choices that can have the biggest repercussions. You're responsible for what happens. You're culpable. And I look forward to killing them all. I can't interfere. That's very much against the rules. I can only observe what happens and record any significant events. Oh. Ever seen one of these? They're very old. People used to call them obbles. They'd put them now? in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Look out for The them. ferryman. You'll find them in the strangest Little places. Hope. I'll be happy to exchange any that you find. Oh. And I'll certainly make it worth your while. So, are they like hint coins? That's interesting. Okay. Well, shall we start? Game is afoot. I will be watching. <laughs> I'm just thinking of, has anyone seen in Parks and Rec where uh, Chris Pratt says, a game, a Wilder. game is the, th the I've foot. I've got a master's in criminal psychology. <laughs> I'm an investigative journalist and hope to make a difference. You may have recently seen my interview on Chicago AM on Ticket of Hands. Uh, 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 and, uh, and yeah, it's really tough when just being honest means everyone thinks you're a bitch. <laughs> I'm not. Sure, I've got issues to deal with, same as everyone. I I'm working on it. I. Hey, I'm Mark. I study photography at UCLA. Um, at a great time. Really want to get back into some serious photography. Uh, but yeah, it's a it's a job. I've been a key grip and lighting tech for years. Oh, hey, Fliss. No <laughs> problem. Light it. I you don't often meet someone like that. Man, how do you even start? Okay, so we got our on-camera lady, our photographer, our Sorry, lighting you person. Any qualifications or, um, like, personal info? Because I don't, I mean, will anyone access this? I'm kind of private, actually. Uh, yeah, Charlie Lonnit, UK originally. I've uh, been here a for Brit. 20 years. The last series was so on track. It was, uh, it was a very beautifully conceived and um, didn't quite uh, uh, hit the mark as I was hoping it would. This is a lot of exposition to take in so early. <laughs> oh, okay. I think we've heard quite enough. Enough? <laughs> oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. You don't seem to understand. That's not I the same guy. The devil in me. That's the name. <laughs> I could not help the fact that I was a murderer any more than a poet can help the inspiration to sing. So is that his son? Bury me deep, your honor. Make sure they fill my pine box with cement. Put me deeper than anyone else and cover the ground with more cement. Cause no, Catherine, please just wet, wet mud. Just being dead ain't enough to stop me from killing again. On May 7th, 1896, Herman Mudgett, a.k.a. Henry H. Holmes, was sent to the gallows. His neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Mm -hmm. Records indicate he hung, slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes, until finally the monster was dead. America's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders 
Ooh. But his investigators sifted through the traces he left behind, following his path from city to city. The number grew significantly. Nearly 200 lives. So was this supposed to be America's based on an actual guy? first serial killer, and possibly the worst. He was buried as requested, under concrete. Was he hoping to hide from God's judgment? Or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again? So I just realized that's not his son, it's a guy, it's an actor playing a reenact. Got it, got it. So, what do you think? It's pretty good. To be honest, Charlie, this is a pilot. <laughs> Hold that thought. I quite liked it. Lonnet Entertainment. Charles Lonnet, please. Speaking. Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What can I do for you, Mr. Dumet? Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. I'm certainly grateful to you, Mr. <clears throat> Dumet. This all sounds amazing, but I, uh, I just, I'm waiting to hear what the catch is. Oh, the catch no, is going to be murder, surely. <laughs> I'm in a privileged position. I don't need for much, but my time is at a premium. We need to do this today. I'll send a car for you this afternoon, 4 p.m. Be ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days shoot. I've told my team they're free this weekend, and frankly, they're a temperamental bunch. Oh, this will be Without fun. them, this conversation is dead in the water. We, uh... I've told you what I have. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? Yes, of course. We're in. I'll get them there. I promise. Oh, Charlie received a call from Grantham Dumet and accepted an invitation to his H.H. H. Holmes inspired murder castle. So I'm getting a feeling this is not just going to be inspired, but he's going to do some killing. Um, Hang on, while I'm paused, I just want to say, oh my god, so, so much stuff happening. Um, the, the bit with the curator was really cool, and I forgot that this is the end of season one, so I'm wondering if they're going to maybe replace the curator with someone else, because he seemed to be getting pretty introspective there. I don't know. Anyway, back to our ragtag group. Uh, yes. Let's do it. I've already forgotten what few names Mr. I learned. Dumet send you. We... Right, let's load up, guys. All right, got it. I'm good. This all feels very ominous. <laughs> Sorry. Are you? I mean, this is that ring light that makes you all glowy. We leave them behind it. You're right. This is going to be grand, people. Yeah, it's going to be so good, isn't it? <laughs> Excitement. Anyone? Road trip. Huzzah! <laughs> Woohoo! Hooray. This is going to be great, guys. I'm so excited. I wish they'd kept um, Jesse Buckley's Irish accent, though. I'm sad. Exactly. <laughs> Love a good Irish nice. accent. You know what this just reminds me of? Don't say it. Topeka. Exactly. Me, no money in my pocket, a dead phone, and lost in the middle of goddamn Topeka. That wasn't my fault. It was 100% your fault, because you fly by the seat of your ass. So, come on, Charlie. What do we know about this guy? He's rich, he's a recluse, he's obsessed with H.H. H. Holmes. Totally saying I'm Sounds like a murderer. Property he inherited from a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Some of the rooms are full recreations from the murder castle. Dumet has blueprints, documents, artifacts. When I said this would save the show, I was not exaggerating. And you substantiated all of this? Just trust me. Sounds pretty cool Sorry to be honest. Sorry for all the mystery. Before we go any further, I have to ask that we lock up your phones for safekeeping. Oh, no, that's so dodgy. While this that I invite you to film the collection inside my home, I cannot allow any personal devices that may share information that could affect my this? business or lifestyle. There are rules. All footage you wish to use must be authorized by me first. I require privacy and discretion. I must insist. His place, his rules. Very strange. Look, what he's offering us is worth it. Could be making us pay, but he isn't. 
If this is all he asks, then we do. Fine. For the show. Guys, this could not be more obviously sketch if it tried. You said that in Topeka. <laughs> well, this is all gonna go well, isn't it? <laughs> All right, so I wonder where we are now. If this dude is so rich, shouldn't he have service or something? This guy gonna help? <clears throat> no, really, I got it. Thanks, bro. Don't sweat it, jackass. Hey, why are you angry at everyone, lady? Is her name Jamie? Okay. So now what? I'd love to get some footage of the lake and Charlie. the scope of this. Lake Michigan. Not with so we're still in Chicago. The there. From on high, we'll get a better look. Oh, cool. That's certainly um, up there. The, the visuals will be great and we can frame up over in the mist. Charlie, you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there. I'm fit as a butcher's dog. <laughs> Mark, this is crazy. But we'll be fine. Let's go, Charlie. Be careful, guys. Nice knowing you. Come on. Oh, cool. Shoot some footage from the top of the lighthouse. Um, yeah, I'm not going to lie. I don't know. This all looks kind of fun to me. If I was part of a documentary crew or whatever they are, I, even though it's totally sketchy, I would have a very fun time doing something like this. <laughs> maybe, maybe it's that I would find all the murdery stuff interesting. Um, anyway. Can we chat? Oh, hey, I've just noticed I have gained the ability to run in this game. That's nice. Uh, okay, press X to climb. <sighs> right, let's go somewhere. Oh my god, we're doing boosting. This is taking too. This this is so cool. so fun. I even even that wildly excites me. Don't know why, but Hey, guys, hurry up. We're on it. Yeah. I'm jogging. Cool. This finally finally walk faster actually makes you walk faster. Oh, cool. Wait, so I, I remember seeing that they'd added, like, exploration mechanics and stuff, but now we're actually running and climbing shit? It's meant to be heard from miles away. That's fun. Well, yeah, I know that in theory, but... Explore the cliffs to find an alternate route. Warning! Cliff Isn't erosion! Too serious? The warning about everything falling into the ocean. I'm gonna say we trust These cliffs are subject to erosion yeah. may collapse into deep water without warning. Make them put it up. I'm sure it's fine. Uh, Hard so... Uh, what's what's the betting that the whole thing is going to fall into the ocean at the end of the game? Ooh, um, so much for plan a. Do we, we get to do some clambering? Come on. Oh, cool. <laughs> Anything for a shot, right? Listen, Mark, I just wanted to say um, thanks for backing me up, man. What? About getting this footage? No, for the whole trip. <laughs> you know some of the crew can be challenging. To work with. Jamie and Kate would never have agreed to come if you hadn't. I really feel like I, I know this voice or something. The episode was such a mess. We needed all the help we could get. Right. Yeah. What was so bad about it? <laughs> right, so it was what they were saying in the trial while I was being overwhelmed with new information was that the, the fake trial was that the real HH Holmes said you have to bury me in concrete so that the devil doesn't escape out of me because okay, I'm only evil because the devil is in I me. I was hoping being here all remote and away from the world that maybe I'd have some downtime, some space to decompress. Downtime? Why would you want to do um, that? Guys, sh you know, sh we've got a thing to read. Relax a bit. I've never seen the attraction. You're weird. I love downtime. Um, in memory of That's the victim, in memory of the victims of the great storm of May 1st, 1907, in which 187 lives were lost, the crew and passengers of the SS Cassiopeia, ooh, a shipwreck, which cracked, crashed into the rocks at the base of these cliff, cliffs. Oh my god, I can't read today. Oh, okay. Interesting. 
hope we get to go and explore that shipwreck at some point. Don't see why we would be diving. We already did that in Man and Padan, but a girl can dream. This is fun. I like all the clambering. Shout out to this game, by the way, for actually um, telling you when you're about to leave the area so that you don't have to do the thing where you were like guessing if you're going, if you're about to like lock yourself out of an area. Love that. Uh, oh, 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 fun. Oh, awesome. I am loving these new, new exploration hey, stuff. Wrap, I'd like to take a couple weeks off, go see my family. I need you in post. I really appreciate that discerning eye of yours, you know. I got a lot going on at the moment, Charlie. Oh, right, yeah, of course, sure. Take a couple of weeks. Get your head together. I appreciate it. I'll be fine in post on my own. Well, that was a quick change of heart, Charlie. Same. Take some time out. You got any family you can go and bother? Oh, man, oh, we can crouch. No. no, Mrs. Bonnet, you got hiding in some closet somewhere? Married to the job. Married to the job. <laughs> oh, balancing. Oh, my God, I'm bad at this. Well, from what I hear about real marriages, pretty damn good. This is gonna get me killed. Married I, I can job. see it already. Damn. Look at you. Oh, sorry, my cat wanted to come in. <laughs> Where were we? Um. Right, this way. Oh, it was that X to go through the gap. Fucking God! Christ, what the hell is that? A mannequin. You know, <gasps> just hanging out. Maybe it's part of some old museum display or something. Oh my right. God. That's probably it. Oh my God. Oh my heart. <clears throat> that... That stressed me out. <laughs> I was not expecting to get so jump scared so early in the game. Or I, mean, I should I should know by now that these games are very jump scare heavy, but still. <laughs> Did we make it? Cool. Let's shoot some me. footage. Yeah. Just looking at the light on the mist. Oh, what? How is that going to fit into the show? It just caught my eye. Coming. The light on the mist. Always the photographer. Oh. I can't exactly <laughs> turn it off. There's I thought he was talking about some mysterious light. Stuff commercial stuff. Hmm. You sure about that? Because crossover with Kate hasn't exactly... We agreed to let that drop for the weekend. Just making sure your head's in the game. Locked tight. Okay. Come on. There must be another way. You sure? No. I'm optimistic. Uh, oh, we can shimmy through that gap, but I also want to see what's here. That something? No. <laughs> okay, let's go in here. Oh, do I need to get a key or something? Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. Oh, I was hoping I could crouch. Never mind. Okay, we'll go through that gap. This, I, I really like this. It feels more like <laughs> video gamey. Like, I liked it fine with, like, just when it was mostly just dialogue and finding things, but it's always cool if you can add some gamey elements, you know? Oh, okay. Don't jump scare me again. <laughs> My heart can't take it. Key anywhere? Nice one, boys. What's that look for, mate? All right. What have we got here? Oh, <laughs> I just got jump scared by that too. This looks pretty old. 
Wait, I forgot what that was that I... Oh! Charlie can use his tie clip to open lock boxes! Oh, that's so cool! So each character has their own, like, thing. <gasps> a coin! What's that? Just An oval. Used to unlock dioramas? Okay. Interesting! Ooh, so many new things. You know, it does seem kind of odd that they added all the all these new mechanics in for the end of season one and not the start of season two. Look, sorry, but I'm not complaining. Now and again, but I really couldn't make these shows without you. That's not true. I may be driving this car. What car? The Lonnet Entertainment car. But you're the one who keeps the engine going. It's not how cars work. Jesus, you try and give someone Ooh. a compliment. Thanks, Charlie. Okay. I get it. Guessing this is going to be locked, but let's just trip. Char, whatever your name is, get out of the way. It's going to be locked. Uh, square to grab hold. L to move them. Yep, pretty standard. Okay. Let's go. Uh, where do I? <laughs> oh. Why is it giving? Can I? Okay. <laughs> I know I need to grab it, but where do I grab it from? From here? There we go. <laughs> so apparently I was like, yeah, yeah, I've done this before, but apparently I did need telling how to do it. Just a little breaking and entering. How are you not in jail? <laughs> Christ, what the hell is that? Approach a hiding place and hold... Oh, my God. Okay. Oh. Oh, this is new. Crew members won't be spotted when hiding. Nice to meet you, too. What, what was that? Was I supposed to... Was it an animal? No? Oh, interesting. Okay. Oh, that's a lighter, not a torch. Very strong light. Your lighter emits there, old friend. Oh my god, move out of the way. <laughs> uh, okay, what have we got here? Have we got a key by any chance? Uh, another gap, but I just wanted to check there wasn't anything in here. Okay, let's go. This is very cool. Oh, shimmy. <laughs> Don't jump scare me again, Just please. I'll never sheets, forgive you for that. Some nice drapes. And six gallons of sanitizer. You know what this reminds me of is those guys from Resident Evil 7 from the tapes that all get very killed. Can't remember their names. There was Clancy and those two other dudes. Ooh. Oh, okay, someone is into rodent killing. Charlie, I'm getting an uneasy feeling about this. Don't say. Name. Somebody has a taxidermy hobby. Relax. <laughs> Some hobby. Ah! It moved. What? The thing. It moved. Did it, like, drop something out of his mouth or something? Inspect. Mm, okay. Well, that was scary. <laughs> can, can we... Did I just see a thing? No? Okay, onwards. Oh! Aha! Let's go. It's gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. You scared of heights, friend? Look at this. It's perfect. Come on, get shooting. I want you to pan across the lake until the island comes into shot. Then zoom into that lighthouse. Look, it's all right. Come on, we better get back. All that effort for that for that one shot you don't want to you don't want to get a couple more establishing shots for <laughs> okay after all that well this is cool is that him i don't know 
We just had the long coat. How did he know what our show was about in the first place? Uh, actually, I didn't ask. That's weird. Let's just be asking nice, these okay? questions, Charlie. Hello, Hello, Alex from Man of Medan. Mr. Lonnet. That's me. I'm Grantham Demet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. Oh, you're Demet, okay. This is Mark. Mark. Erin, Jamie. Ladies. And this is Kate. Pleased Got to it. meet you, Mr. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. What say we get underway? Again, I... Um... The crew met Grantham Demet. Really He's a poet and he didn't know it. For this opportunity. Of course. Was it your great uncle you said that... Um... Let's get to where we're going. I'll explain everything later. Oh, sure. I don't... I just don't trust him. <laughs> we're off on an adventure. Oh no, who's watching us? And so it's a hotel on like an isolated island or something. That's always good for if you need to escape. <laughs> This has me feeling very uneasy already. Let's get up to the hotel. Please, let's stay close. Stick together. Is it oh, dangerous okay, okay. here? No, of course not. You sure? Because you don't seem sure. It's perfectly safe, but we are a long ways from help if somebody gets hurt. So please, take care. That seems deliberate. Looks like things have buttoned up tight around here. God. This way. Don't worry about your bags. I'll make sure they're brought. Um. Try not to cough up a lung, Charlie. Slow, deep breaths, Charles. So. Try not to cough up a diseased lung. I'll be fine. Is this Just foreshadowing for like he's gonna end up in that hill. smoke chamber or that gas chamber or something? You're right. He takes so he's got like lung issues. I wonder what he's afraid will get in. Maybe you should be asking what he's trying not to let out. Jamie. Mm -hmm. Just saying. You watch too many horror movies. He values his privacy. We've known that right from the start. We've known that for about two hours. Just go. Mark, get your camera. I wanna grab a quick intro from here. I need some shots leading up to the house. Don't need the whole journey. Kate, talking to camera, then I'll direct you from there, okay? No photos. No recording of me at all. Is that clear? I'm a very private person. If this does not I add up, though. Dinner. Discretion is Lonnet Entertainment's motto. You want the usual intro stuff, Charlie? Please. The light is good. I'm ready to go, Aaron. It sounds clear. Okay, let's go for a tag then. Is Kate's face ready? Bitch, I'm always camera ready. Stop trying to make me like you. Rolling. Speed. And action. I've just arrived on the private island which claims to have genuine artifacts from H.H. H. Holmes' reign of terror. I'm heading to the house right now. Ooh. Perfect, Kate. Now turn to face the house and start to walk. OK, that's enough. Dude, you just got in the fucking really shot. You really do need to get going. Anything you say, Mr. Dumas. Way to ruin the shot. This way. You'll steal some more shots, right? Obviously. Who is that? You prepping the murders? Mr. Dumet is being really restrictive. I noticed. I want you to get a look around without him knowing. A man is entitled to his privacy. He's cagey. I want to know what he's trying to hide. What do you want to do? What you did that time with those cops in Glendale. Seriously? Ah, oh, ow, oh, oh, 
Oh my, damn it! What happened? You okay? Did you have your ego again? What's, should, what's that problem with her? <laughs> I can barely move it. Jamie, stay with her. Why me? Because you know first aid. Remember how you patched her up? In Glendale? Oh, right. Okay. We'll find some ice and a bandage and come back. You have that at the hotel? Yes, sure. Then let's go. And this is going to help how exactly? What is going on? Come on. I'll clue you in later. Been taking acting classes again? Yeah, yeah. What's Charlie want? A better lay of the land. And we're the scouts because... Oh, I see. I'm charming, and you can hotwire your way past security. Come on. Okay, explore the island. Can do. Don't mind if I do. Hey, Give me some clues. Can I ask you something and get a straight answer? You know, without you making a smart-ass reply or taking a shot at me. That works both ways. Fine. Oh, tell me the truth. Is there any saving this show? Maybe. If there's some sort of magical holy grail of footage or information Private to be property had here. keep out. Yeah, got that. Got that vibe. Likely. No. At best, we'll get some nice B-roll. That's not gonna save our asses. I can do this. So this show is really that bad, huh? <laughs> but to be fair, like you're, you're making a show about H. H. Holmes, and this guy just happens to have all these artifacts. Like I, I think that would Watch save it. Head. But it's not gonna be that easy. <laughs> Uh, excuse, excuse me? Okay. Ooh. Can we get in there? No. I'm not getting the whole- the hang of this whole running thing, am I? <laughs> oh, I never did find, um, how to get into that locked thing before. Maybe I'll get to go back there? I don't know. Like I keep feeling die. like I'm missing stuff, but I, I don't know. Cry. Thanks for the concern. Really. Okay, so is Kate dating Mark? And did Jamie like used to date him or something? Is that what we're going for? Is that why she's being salty at her? Oh, okay, a building. Ooh. Wonder where this goes. Straight up and down the hill. Yeah. But what's on the other end? Interesting. Oh hell yeah, more boosting. Okay. Do you live out here on this island? Oh. Get down with oh. your family. Oh. My wife is. She died. Oh shit. Oh what? I thought they were. I thought it was safe because they were Mr. gone. Dumet, is this an actual palm tree? Oh my god. Is this shipped into the island? I. I don't think so. So I guess I have to wait till the thing runs out and then it's safe. I'm a little confused by that mechanic. <laughs> Well, that that's going to be difficult and that's going to get me killed in situations where it has actual consequences. I just know it. I'm very curious about this place, though. I'm getting the feeling that, ooh, that I'm getting a feeling that the, the clues are a little more few and far between because I've got bigger areas to explore with all my exploring mechanic type things. Oh god, where do I, where do I, should I go across here first? Ha, yeah. <laughs> so cool. Um, okay, let's, let's go. <laughs> what about over there? <clears throat> Yellow jacket guy, you're creeping me out, assuming that's who this is. 
Wait, do what? Do I? If I wanted to go do I not get to hikes, go in that building? I, I wanted to look to in that city. building. This shit is not in my job description. Oh my god, I thought the building was where I was supposed to go, so I- Oh, it's happened again! <laughs> I thought the building was where I was supposed to go, so I didn't go in it. And now this was where I was supposed to go. Oh, I thought this was just an extra thing to check out. Game, why didn't you tell me that this was gonna- Or maybe it did, and I just ignored it. Oh, oh, I am so upset. I will never get over this, truly. I'm heartbroken. <laughs> I hate when that happens. It's the worst day of my life. Well, that's what the second playthrough is for, I guess. Oh, oh, oh! Oh god, that was hard to find. Well, not hard to... It was not obvious. Okay, well. Good, good. Ah, now I'm even more sad that I missed that last building and potentially that locked building earlier. Oh, I'm so sad. <laughs> Let me back. <laughs> Are you, are you super sure? Oh, whatever. Whatever. I'll get over it eventually. In like 10 years, I'll, what about this over will there? be keeping me up at night. This reminds me of shit summer camps. The quarry. <laughs> By the way, it is super impressive that like, I mean, I know I haven't this could be terrible, I haven't finished it, but um, that they've come out with this and the quarry in the same year. And they both look really good. Okay, if I can get the car moving and stop it here, we'll be able to get across. Oh, okay. Okay. A puzzle. Okay, so that's locked. Wait, so this is act an actual, like, environment puzzle type thing in a dark pitch. This game, very you cool. see the control panel? Oh. It's oh, a puzzle puzzle. Power. Okay, hang on. I'll come back to that. I'm exploring first. Oh, that's so cool. Um. Oh. Is there anything behind there? Oh, hang on. I'm, I don't even know where to go first. I've got loads of places to check out. Um, I mean, yeah. I'm assuming this is just a little extra thing. Oh, 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 oh. These little fuckers are everywhere. I wonder how many I've missed already. Okay, three. Seven? Oh, okay. Well, what? So that that was really valuable because it did not expect me to go there. I guess. <laughs> uh, all right. There must be something around here. Okay, I'm presuming that that is what I have to do before I can try the puzzle. Maybe we can get this thing working. Move the train car. Okay, time for the puzzle. I'm still, I just, I really wanted to be able to explore that building, you guys. <laughs> Jamie. Okay. Can you fix this? Ooh, character change. Um, I've, the multimeter, I can use the multimeter to fix fuse boxes. Okay. I'm really scared for when my life depends on something like this because my experience with that um, switch breaker puzzle in the quarry was, <laughs> You can guess what happened. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. Oh, this is weird. So this one, and then 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 this one. No. Oh! Aha. Wait, but what? Why is follow the arrows? Don't go out of sequence unless you want to trip the whole system. System, but how there's there's two that go to that one. I don't. I don't really. I don't understand. <laughs> uh, let me read this again more carefully. Okay, maybe if I try again, doing the exact same thing. Um. But then I do that. Okay, that was that was kind of weird. That was another kind of weird one, like the break one in the quarry. I don't know. I'm nervous about these puzzles. <laughs> I 
Okay, we're back as Kate. Please, please, can I just go into that one building from before? Please, please. Um, yeah, that, that place is long gone. Hear that? You again? Ah, wet. Okay, okay. Oh, this is nerve wracking. Show me your face. A game is the foot. Okay, so where can I go now? That's just locked. Maybe maybe locked means like it not that it needs a key, but just that it's locked, probably. Wonder what these are. Ooh. Warning, hazardous substance. Oh god, it's Manchurian gold. Oh wait, it's it's probably the stuff for the gas chamber, right? Um is that another thing I can read or? Oh! Oh, that's weird. Oh, that's weird. Um, invoice covalent exchange. Uh, client grant them do met. Description amount. Okay, I didn't know that was a thing I could do. Note to self, I might have missed several uh, notes by sort of not panning in the direction I was supposed to. Okay. I get very distressed and upset when I miss things in these games. <laughs> I want all the clues. Okay, so that's still locked. Good, good, good. Aha! Uh -huh. I am a genius. My genius knows no bounds. I guess I just needed to rest it for a minute. I think I'm okay. We found a shortcut up the hill. I really need you to stay where I say. You got it, Mr. Nah, Dumetch. Don't feel We're like it. Now. Let's head on. Everyone stay under the watchful eye of Mr. Dumet, please. This guy is Kate. so familiar. Why do I feel like I've met this guy in real life, even though he is a face model and a, a different summer voice? Camp from hell. Whatever. Let's see what you We're did then. Find out what's up his sleeve before too long. Don't worry about that. I love the like gloomy Come vibe. Away. Very fun. Uh -huh. You afraid of heights? Maybe. Yes. I bet I can get you to overcome that by the end of the game. Oh shit! We're all gonna die. Oh, that is cruel. <laughs> Just go. <laughs> oh my god, relax, Mark. I don't know how I feel about you, Jamie. Sounds like you're being mean to everyone right now. You good? Oh man. Um you can do it, empathetic. You can do it. Eyes forward. Don't look down. I got it. It's fine. Is it though? I shouldn't have looked. It's just water down there. You can swim. Besides, the bridge looks dependable. This is so coming back later to Come potentially on. die on. I'll if help. I know anything about these games. That's it. Look, it's fine. I'm not looking. Don't look down. Yeah. <laughs> See? Not so bad. She had to physically haul his ass along that bridge. Thank you. You always knew how to get me through the shit, didn't you? We should catch up to Mr. Dumet. 
Where is everyone? Apologies, uh, they're all city folk. Come on, let's go. We're losing the day, people. Such film director speak. Come on, people. So this is the murder castle, is that what they call it? This, wow, Mr. Dumet, this place is magnificent. Yeah, maybe this won't be a waste of a weekend. Uh, who who are you? Hello. Wonder who you are. What are you doing? He saw a girl in the window of the hotel. So that's presumably his daughter. I I saw oh. a little girl up there. Or well, maybe it's ghosts. Maybe it's your one fan. And now she's lost forever. You are girl, such stop a dick. being mean. <laughs> Jamie teased Kate about her fame when talking about the girl they saw. Oh, so she's jealous? And Kate is famous, okay. Everything in here is fragile. Please be careful. What is this guy's accent? Is he is he meant to be British or? Man, this is brilliant. Ooh. Oh. Look at this. It's amazing. This is intense. Would you all mind signing in at the desk, please? Uh, this feels all this too familiar. Isn't everything. I'm sure the rest is almost here. I'll, I'll make sure it gets to your rooms. Kate's makeup case is slowing it down. This girl has such yeah, a problem with me. Nice. Blue backpack. Settle I was a smoker. And I'll meet right. you all at dinner. At eight. Mr. Dumet, I cannot say thank you enough times. This is truly fantastic. I told you all this was a good plan, didn't I? <laughs> I told you. Hey, I haven't found a single dark picture yet. Is that one? On the wall there? Oh, 178. Don't jump scare me, please. <laughs> oh, who are you, old lady? Oh, that's very that creepy. Busy, busy, busy. You've been out in a bad all day. And I have to sit here worrying. Gone all day and not a word from you. Is this the movie Psycho? <laughs> okay, I'm actually gonna relax with Erin. Um, I never know what's a good place to stop in these games because it doesn't really give you like a saving point because it's always saving. But I'm going to stop here. I would love to play more, but I'm getting very tired and I think this is the kind of game that I want my wits about me for. So I'm going to exercise some self-control and pause here for today. Um, but wow, I'm really enjoying this so far. Uh, I feel like it's quite unexpected how um, a lot of that was like... Um, like running around the environment and uh, doing like puzzles and climbing stuff, which is not what I expected from this game. You, you know, usually it's a lot of like chatting and dialogue choices and there hasn't been a lot of that yet. Um, but I'm really liking all the new mechanics, um, especially the hide thing. That's really cool. And I still have not figured it out. Um, yeah. Oh, I'm really excited and intrigued. And this was very fun, especially that prologue has me so excited for all the inevitable murders to come. So yeah, sorry I stopped this one a bit early, you know, before any murders have occurred. But yeah, this is very, very cool. I feel like we have so much to look forward to. And um, 
Yeah, okay, like I said at the beginning, I had completely forgotten that they said this is a season one finale of the Dark Pictures games, which if that means that I have to wait more than a year before this and the next one, because I know they've got no loads of other ones planned, but if this, this means I have to wait more, I will be so sad. I mean, they probably deserve a break because they've been churning out games, um, but my selfish little self wants one every single year forever. Um, so I don't know I don't know what the end of season one means. Like, are they going to take a break? Are they going to carry on... Um, but just change some stuff about the game, like get rid of the curator, because definitely the curator had a. He seemed to be in a different mood today. I don't know, but yeah, so far this is definitely scratching that dark pictures itch that I had. It's dark pictures time of year is my favorite time of year, and I'm just I already can't wait to continue this. Um, I would play this in one sitting if I was not tired. Uh, but anyway, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed, and I hope you join me for the rest of this series. Uh, there will be many deaths, I'm sure of it. But yeah, hit that like button or subscribe if you want to, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. A game is the foot.